What does ISRO stand for? It's Indian Space Research Organization option A. When was ISRO formed? On 15th August 1969 option C. What was the name of ISRO before 1969? It's Indian National Committee for Space Research option B. It was set up by the Government of India in 1962. Where is the headquarters of ISRO located? In Bengaluru of Karnataka option D. What is the name of India's first satellite? Aryabhatta option C. From which place Aryabhatta satellite was launched? From Russia option B. Aryabhatta India's first satellite was launched from the Kapustin Yar launch site in Russia using a C1 Intracosmos launch vehicle. India's second satellite Bhaskar 1 was launched on 7 June 1979 from a Soviet Cosmos drone with the help of the Cosmos 3M rocket. The satellite was intended for Earth observations. Which was the first Indian communication satellite? APPLE option C. The air gain passenger payload experiment was an experimental communication satellite launched by the Indian Space Research Organization on 19 June 1981 by Ariane, a launch vehicle of the European Space Agency. Which was the first Indian educational satellite? EduSat option C. A satellite developed by ISRO to provide two-way satellite communication for distance education in India. It's also known as GSAT-3. It was launched on 20th September 2004 from Satish Dhawan Space Center. Which was the India's first indigenous radar imaging satellite? RISAT-1 Option A RISAT-1 was an India's first indigenously developed all-weather radar imaging satellite successfully launched by a PSLV XL rocket on 26 April 2012 from Satish Dhawan Space Center, Sri Harikota. The RISAT series are the first all-weather Earth observation satellites from ISRO. Which was the first Indian satellite to study oceans? OceanSat-1 Option D, also called IRSP-4. It was part of the Indian Remote Sensing Program satellite series. The launch date, it was launched in 1999 from SHAR Center in Sri Harikota. Which was the first Indian university to launch the satellite? Anna University Option A in Chennai. It was the first university in India to launch a student-made satellite. The satellite called Anusat was launched using the four-stage PSLV in 2009 from Satish Dhawan Space Center in Sri Harikota, Andhra Pradesh, which became the first country to successfully enter Mars orbit on its first attempt. India Option D. On 24 September 2014, through its Mars Orbiter mission, India was also the first Asian country to reach Mars orbit. India's Mars Orbiter mission, also known as Mangalyaan, used the Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle C-25 to launch the satellite on 5th November 2013 from the Satish Dhawan Space Center in Sri Harikota, India which is the first successful moon mission of India. Chandrayaan 3 option C. You may watch the full video on Chandrayaan 1, 2, 3. The link is in the description. Also, you may watch the latest video on National Space Day of India. The link is in the description. Which is the first solar mission of India? It is Aditya L1 option C. Aditya L1 is a coronagraphy spacecraft for studying the solar atmosphere designed and developed by the ISRO and various other Indian space research institutes. It was launched on 2nd September 2023 from Satish Dhawan Space Center. You may watch the top 50 MCQs video on Aditya L1. The link is in the description. 
What is the name of the ISRO mission to send Indian astronauts to low Earth orbit for a short duration on board an Indian launch vehicle? Gaganyaan option B. The crew capacity is 3 and its design life is 7 days. You may watch the full video on Gaganyaan MCQs also. The link is in the description. Which Indian satellite series is primarily used for resource monitoring and management? IRS option C. It provides data for agriculture, forestry, water resources, disaster management and more. Which series of multipurpose satellites support communication, television broadcasting, meteorology and search and rescue operations? INSAT option B. Commissioned in 1983, INSAT is the largest domestic communication system in the Indo-Pacific region. It is a joint venture of the Department of Space, Department of Telecommunication, India Meteorological Department and All India Radio and Doordarshan. Who was the first Indian to go to space? Rakesh Sharma Option A. In 1984, Rakesh Sharma became the first Indian in space. He was part of the Soviet Soyuz T-11 mission. Who is considered the father of the Indian space program? Vikram Sarabhai Option A. He was the first chairman of ISRO as well. Sarabhai was honored with Padma Bhushan in 1966 and Padma Vibhushan in 1972 posthumously. In which year was the first rocket launched from India? In 1963, option C. Where was India's first rocket launching station made? In Thumba, option B. Thumba is a coastal area in Thiruvananthapuram, the capital of Kerala, India. Thumba Equatorial Rocket Launching Station is India's first rocket launch station, which lies near to the equator. TERLS is operated by ISRO. TERLS was renamed as the Vikram Sarabhai Space Center in 1972 after the death of Dr. Vikram Sarabhai, the father of Indian space program. What was the name of the first rocket launched from Thumba? Nike Apache Option B. Nike Apache sounding rocket was made in rocket launch from the Thumba Equatorial Rocket Launching Station on 21st November 1963, which is India's first lunar mission. Chandrayaan 1 Option D. It was launched on 22nd October 2008 and it was live till 28 August 2009. Which was India's first Mars Orbiter mission? Mangalyaan Option A How many stages were there in ASLV Augmented Satellite Launch Vehicle? 5 Stages Option A ASLV was a 5-stage all-solid propellant vehicle with the mission of orbiting 150 kg class satellites into 400 km circular orbits. How many stages are there in GSLV, Geosynchronous Launch Vehicle? Three stages option B. It is a fourth generation launch vehicle designed to place communication satellites in geostationary transfer orbit using a cryogenic third stage. It was used for launching Chandrayaan-2 also. GSLV is capable of placing up to 6 tons of payloads in low earth orbits from heavy satellites to multiple smaller satellites. When did ISRO launch its first PSLV, Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle? In 1994, option D, it is India's third generation launch vehicle, first successfully launched in October 1994. It is the first Indian launch vehicle to have liquid stages. It is a four-stage vehicle with multiple satellite launch capabilities and multiple orbit capabilities. It is regarded as the workhorse of ISRO for low Earth orbits. Numerous Indian and foreign customer satellites have been launched by PSLV. It successfully launched Chandrayaan-1 in 2008 and Mars Orbiter spacecraft in 2013. Which launch vehicle is used to launch heavier satellites? GSLV option B. 
GSLV stands for Geosynchronous Satellite Launch Vehicle. It's a type of rocket developed by India's ISRO to launch satellites into geostationary orbit. The GSLV Mark III is the most powerful satellite launch vehicle developed by ISRO till date. It carried the Chandrayaan-2 to its designated orbit and was given the title of India's Bahubali for its advanced capabilities. Which organization has launched Earth Observation Satellite 8 EOS-8 using its small satellite launch vehicle SSLV? ISRO Option C. ISRO launched the Earth Observation Satellite 8 through its newly developed SSLV D3. The launch took place on the Independence Day of India on 15th August. The key objectives of the EOS-8 mission are design and development of a microsatellite for earth observation purposes, developing advanced payload instruments that are compatible with the microsatellite bus, ensuring seamless integration and functionality, implementing and testing new technologies that are essential for the next generation of operational satellites, paving the way for future advancements. Who is the chairman of ISRO at present? S. Somnath Option B. S. Somnath was appointed as the 10th ISRO chief on 12 January 2022. He also serves as both a secretary to the Government of India and an executive of the Department of Space. Who is known as Missile Man of India? APJ Abdul Kalam Option C. He was an Indian aerospace scientist who served as the 11th President of India also from 2002 to 2007 the major awards won by him in his lifetime are padma bhushan the third highest civilian honor of india in 1981 padma vibhushan the second highest civilian honor of india in 1990 bharat ratna the highest civilian honor of india in 1997 and ramanujan award in 2000 you may watch the biography of apj abdul kalam the link is in the description what was the name of first successful nuclear test conducted in India in 1974? Operation Smiling Buddha Option C To know more about the successful nuclear test by India, you may watch the video on National Technology Day. The link is in the description. Who among the following is known as the father of India's nuclear program? Homi J. Bhabha, Option B. He was an Indian nuclear physicist. He got the Adams Prize in 1942 and Padma Bhushan in 1954. Who among the following is known as the Moon Man of India? Mile Swami Annadurai, Option C. He was a program director of Chandrayaan 1, Chandrayaan 2, and Mangalyaan. He got the Padma Shri in year 2016. Who among the following is known as the Rocket Man of India? K. Sivan, Option B. He served as the Secretary of the Department of Space and Chairman of the ISRO and Space Commission. Also served as the Director of the Vikram Sarabhai Space Center and the Liquid Propulsion System Center. He was awarded with Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam Award in year 2019. Who among the following is known as the Rocket Woman of India? Ritu Karidhal, Option A. She was a Deputy Operations Director to India's Mars Orbital Mission Mangalyaan. She supervised the Chandrayaan-2 mission as the Mission Director in it. What is the name of India's Space University? Indian Institute of Space Science and Technology, IIST, Option A. It was established in year 2007 by the Indian Space Research Organization in Thiruvananthapuram of Kerala. NASA is the space agency of which country? Of USA Option D. It's National Aeronautics and Space Administration. Here are some more space agency names of different countries. The space agency of Europe is known as ESA, European Space Agency. Roscosmos, Russian Federal Space Agency, is the space agency of Russia. China's space agency is known as CNSA, China National Space Administration. 
in JAXA, Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency is the space agency of Japan. Falcon 9 is the world's first orbital class reusable rocket with two stages designed and manufactured by Blank. SpaceX Option A Falcon 9 is capable of launching payload of 22 metric tons to the low Earth orbit and 8 metric tons to geostationary orbit. SpaceX the founder is Elon Musk, CEO is Elon Musk. It was founded in year 2002 and its headquarters is in Hawthorne of California in US. Soyuz 5 is one of the heaviest launch vehicle of the blank space agency. Russian option C with capability of launching 17 metric tons to the lower earth orbit. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.